Great to see everybody out here. Appreciate the great turnout. And uh, we are going to go out soul winning. And I know a lot of you, this is your first time ever going out soul winning. And that's great because that's the whole reason why we put on this event is to get some people out soul winning for the very first time. And so I'm really happy that it seems like at least half of the people here have never gone out. So if that's you, you're not alone. Don't worry about it. So we're broken into teams. Everybody needs to be on a team. And you're either on Rob's team, Shane's team, John's team, or who's my other team leader? Norman. 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 So there are four team leaders. Is there anybody who's not on a team? Put up your hand if you've not been recruited to a team. All right. Make sure that you exchange phone numbers with your team leader. And that's going to be your group that you organize with. Okay. So as soon as we're done here, you're going to get with that group, have just a quick powwow of just a couple minutes. Everybody's going to have an address to type into your phone to go out into the field and get started out soul winning in your area. Now, as far as how the soul winning goes, usually when we go soul winning in Phoenix, we start out by saying, hi, I'm from Faith War Baptist Church and we're inviting them to church. But because we don't have a church in this area, what you're going to be doing instead is just saying something along the lines of, hey, we're just out in the neighborhood handing out this DVD. Are you a Christian? And then from there, you can lead into your normal, well, hey, more important than, than this DVD, just for you personally, do you know for sure if you die today that you go to heaven? Or just, hey, are you a Christian? Yes, no, okay, well, do you know for sure if you die today, you go to heaven? So that's kind of your opener, okay? So what we're giving out today is we have these DVDs from our Guyana <laughs> mission trip, and this is a great DVD to give away out soul winning because it has seven sermons that are centered around getting someone saved. They're centered around the gospel. It has seven sermons that were preached in public schools to unsaved kids. So if there's anybody who doesn't get saved, this will water that seed because this will really hammer in the plan of salvation from seven different angles. Or if they do get saved, this will reinforce it and also hopefully inspire them to want to be a soul winner. And if they're already a Christian, then you know hopefully this will get them motivated, get them excited. If they're not home, leave this on the door okay so we're, we have plenty of these dvds so leave it behind even if they're not home so we've got these youtube cards right here and we've got these dvds so every door <coughs> gets a dvd and a youtube card all right? all right if not home leave them both and just give these things away like they're going out of style if somebody's really excited and like wow this is so cool thank you i'm so excited Give them like three of them and say, here, give a few to your friends, you know, if somebody's really pumped about it, okay? And then we also have some other DVDs if you want to grab a few of these. the uh, These are just two sermons on one DVD. And so uh, if, if you run into somebody again that's real excited, you can give them a few different titles and so forth. Okay, does anybody have any questions about any of that? Does that all make sense? All right, great. So let's get out there. We're gonna we're gonna be soul winning from around 10:30 to 12:30. Be sure that you meet up with your team leader at 12:30. Don't just be at 12:45 out floating around and nobody knows where you're at. Get back to the cars. Get back to the rendezvous point, the extraction point by 12:30, and then uh, so that means don't start giving somebody the gospel at 12:25. You know, if it's 12:15 and you're not in a conversation, time to start heading back for the car. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and have a word of prayer and let's get out there and do it. As soon as I'm done praying, just uh, load up on material and get with your team leader. All right, let's go ahead and pray. Dear Lord, thank you so much for the opportunity to be here in Maine, Lord. And I just pray that you would just bless our time out today and guide us and direct us to people that would be receptive to the gospel. And we love you and thank you for the chance to be here today. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. amen.